The thing that gets me out of bed in the morning is the people. Uh, I love working with uh, such a diverse uh, group of people. They're all such high energy, high enthusiasm types. I think that's one of the great things about working in a sort of a dynamic sales business. My name is Brett Johnson and I studied an MBA executive program with RMIT through Open Universities Australia. So I work in recruitment and HR advisory at Allegis. It's the fourth largest recruitment firm in the world. My role here is General Manager of Victoria. Our role is effectively to help great organisations build great teams. So a typical day for me begins with our sort of agile stand-up in the morning. I think it allows people to kind of see what each other are working on and kind of chime in with uh, tips and tricks and best practices to help them get to where they want to go. From there, my days are just, there are a lot of meetings with CEOs, CFO, heads of HR really around understanding what their priorities are, understanding how the talent strategy links to those priorities, and then see what role we can play in helping them bring that talent strategy to life. When I was appointed in my first leadership position, it was a sort of a look in the mirror moment, and I became aware that you know, I wasn't really in a position to be guiding people and advising people as, uh, as well as I could have been, and looked to the OUA MBA program to help me fill some of those gaps. and. What I found very quickly was it actually gave me a set of tools and frameworks that it actually made my interactions with people in my team and customers and other stakeholders much more powerful. One of the things I particularly loved about it was the ability to kind of borrow subjects from different postgraduate programs. I did one at Swinburne, I did another one at uh, Griffith University, and it was almost like a DIY tailored MBA program. So my ultimate career goal is to become a CEO of a publicly listed company. My plan is, thanks to OUA for sort of lighting this fire, but it's really around constant self-improvement. Watch a lot of TED videos, listen to a lot of podcasts to just kind of help develop and hone skills that might be needed in that type of role. It's uh, probably ambitious, but um, yeah, that's, that's, my, that's my goal. For someone looking at getting into HR, HR is really about unleashing potential. So if you sort of are passionate about helping candidates realise their dreams and realise unfulfilled potential, then this might be the career pathway for you.